You might have heard people say that the camera adds 10 pounds, or around four and a half kilograms if you want to get metric about it. And sure, it's a cliche, but it also holds a bit of truth about the way cameras don't quite capture the world the way our eyes see it. A lot goes into taking a picture, but there are two main things that might make you think you look a little wider on camera. The first is the fact that most cameras are cyclopses. Their lens is their only eye. And most of us perceive the world through two eyes, where one can see a bit behind things that are directly in front of the other. Our brains stitch together the two images to give us a sense of depth. But Cameras usually don't have a second eye to see around something in front of it, like a face. So compared to your normal eyesight, your brain might think a face in a photo or video is wider, since it covers up more of what's behind it than you're used to. And secondly, you might think you look one way, but cameras have a different perspective. You're probably used to seeing your face relatively close up in a mirror, with your ears a couple of centimeters back and your nose a couple of centimeters closer. Since a few centimeters is a big fraction of that face mirror distance, your face appears slightly longer and thinner. But cameras could be much farther away, making your face appear a little wider or flatter. Not to mention, each camera lens has something called a focal length, which can influence how you and the background look. A camera lens focuses incoming light rays so that they meet at a point and form a sharp, clear image. Focal length describes the distance between the spot inside the camera where the light rays meet and where the sensor detects the image, and it's usually measured in millimeters. Shorter focal length means you get a wider view of a scene. They can also make closer things appear relatively bigger, and farther things appear relatively smaller, which leads to the same face narrowing effect. On the other hand, longer focal length lengths capture a more zoomed-in image, which you can use to take a photo from farther away, or focus on a smaller part of a scene. And if your subject is a person, they might look a little flatter or stretched out. So sometimes, the camera can seem like it adds 10 pounds. But don't sweat it. That selfie probably came out fine. Thanks for asking, and thanks especially to all of our patrons on Patreon who keep these answers coming. If you'd like to submit questions to be answered, go to patreon.com scishow, and don't forget to go to youtube.com scishow and subscribe. It's called the red eye effect, but it doesn't mean you can secretly fire laser beams from your eyes or anything. Instead, you can blame the bright flash of the camera and how your eye adapts to changes in light.